I want to say this to the homosexual community. We mean you no harm. And in fact, I don't even think government should be in the marriage business. Okay? I don't. But, but no, it's not. But be, put that aside for right now. We all have family and friends that are probably in, in that community. Some handle it with a lot of dignity and do the right thing. I'm going to tell the, all of you, I don't care who you are, where you're from, I don't care if you're a homosexual in New York or Hawaii or Arizona, I don't care. Let's look at this. First, we ask you that you understand the history of America and that the intention of the Founding Fathers in developing a constitution that does one thing and did one thing, protect God-given innate rights. You're never going to convince us that homosexual marriage is one of those innate God-given rights. It's not. It's not. It's not one of those rights. If you read the Bible, you will see that it's plain and simply is not. However, even if, with that, we're still willing to sit down with you so that everybody's constitutional God-given rights are protected. We will work hand in hand with any American who wants to join with us in that. Irrespective of race, color, or creed, or what you believe, or what your sexual preference is. But we, as parents, in the United States of America and in the state of Utah. We have rights and we choose not to teach that to our children and we don't want you teaching it to them either. And don't, don't shove your agenda in our faces and don't shove it down our throats. And we don't want any more of your gay appreciation parades. And we don't want any more of this that we're going to teach this in the schools without our permission and without us being involved. We don't want it taught there. Do not shove this agenda in our face or down our throats. We have a right to that. And you're not respecting our rights as parents. And when we come to the table on that issue and you respect our rights, we're going to get somewhere in dealing with this issue. What we're here tonight for is to, so that you leave here with no mistaken uh, ideas about the proper role of government and who's really in charge of the state of Utah, okay? I'm going to show you the proof. What Sam just reviewed with you is a drop in the bucket of what's really going on in the country. This is about changing America, county by county, state by state. This is what we're about. We're dealing with sheriffs and chiefs of police and cops all across the country to do one thing. Keep your word. When you swore an oath in God's name to uphold, defend, protect, and preserve the U.S. Constitution, that you will do that first. You